everybody. This uh, video is going to show you how to install Phoenix on your Windows device without having to enter the source in Kodi. So the first thing you're going to want to do is go to the uh, fusion.tvaddons.ag right? and you should be uh, you should come up with this list here. Uh, so what I'm going to go ahead and do is click right here where it says Kodi repos right and uh, you're given these uh, choices so I'll go ahead and click English and uh, you'll get a list of all the different add-ons uh, that are available here through TV add-ons so, alright so what we're looking for here is the repository uh, XBMC hub right uh, and we're just gonna go ahead and download this repository here so that's it. Now all we have to do is open Kodi on our uh, Windows 10 computer here. All right, so what I want you to do is click on add-ons. All right, and then we're going to click up here for the file manager. And we're going to go ahead and say install from zip file. You uh, you may get this pop up here that says uh, for security installation of add-ons from unknown sources is disabled. So we're going to go ahead and click here where it says settings. And uh, where it says unknown sources, we'll just give it a click. It's going to ask us, are we sure we want to do this? We're going to say, of course we do. And then let's go backwards. So now when we click on install from zip, um, we get our little list here. Uh, I'm going to be looking for this in our download folder. So uh, on a Windows computer, you go to your C drive. You would go to user. You would find your username. In this case, my uh, username is agent86. And there's our download folder. So. Uh, if we go through here, here's what we just downloaded right now, repository.xbmc hub. Uh, this is version 1.0.7. So if we click right here, it's going to go ahead and install the repository for us. And uh, as soon as the repository is installed, we should get a notification up here in the uh, right-hand corner. Once the repository has been installed, you can go ahead and click where it says install from repository all right so we see the uh, TV add-ons AG add-on repository has been installed so if we just click in here uh, we're faced with these options and uh, in this case we're going to go ahead and click video add-ons so here's a list of all of the add-ons including Phoenix which is the reason that we came here so let's go ahead and click on Phoenix and we're gonna go ahead and say install it's gonna start the download And there we go. Phoenix is now enabled. So if we go backwards to the home, we will see that uh, in our uh, video add-ons, All right, if we go to our video add-ons, we can see now that Phoenix uh, is indeed on the uh, unit. And uh, we can go ahead and start enjoying Phoenix. 
uh, keep in mind you can install uh, any add-on that is in that uh, repository that you just downloaded a lot of good stuff in there so I definitely hope this video helped if you have any questions uh, go ahead and comment below and uh, last but not least don't forget to subscribe thanks again for watching have a great day